Hello and welcome back my friends to some Mass Effect Andromeda. I'm really enjoying this game so far and I hope you guys are too. And here we are at the loadout station and you guys know what that means? Oh yes, I did some crafting again. Uh, I just like to change out my loadout every now and then and hopefully this will be a loadout I uh, enjoy. I also fiddled about a bit with my skills, nothing major, but I'll go through that as well. Uh, I will not be as long-winded as I was last time, so let's just go through this real quick. So here we are. Yes, I have three weapons again. And every time I've created three weapons, I end up changing the third weapon. Because it doesn't fit, or I switch to it when I don't want to switch to it, etc. But we'll try and make this work. So basically, these two are the same uh, as you've seen before. Good old reliable weapons. Uh... Here we have the Dauntless Pattern uh, Cyclone LMG. Uh, and here you can see the, the power-ups I have for this. You can pa pause the video and watch this if you want. Uh, well, actually... <laughs> oh my god, I just can't stop talking about my things. I'm so sorry, guys. But, oh my god, I'm so excited about my crafting, okay? Okay, so, so what I've done here is <laughs> uh, increase the clip size by 20% when special ammo is active. So I figured out that I have a whole lot of money, 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 and I keep, I, I have a whole lot of special ammo as well. So I think this will give me quite the bang for my buck, so to speak, because I'm, I will try to almost always have some sort of special ammo active. Not always, but when I when I remember it. Uh, so this is the Dauntless Pattern uh, LMG, and we have... This is my third weapon, so there's a story behind all of this. So, David, I hear you say, David, why are you using the Avenger? This, the, 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 the beginner weapon. And the truth is, it's been a, a companion to me through almost all the Mass Effect games. It is the most used weapon I have had in all the Mass Effect games, single player at least. And it's just so reliable. It does what it's supposed to do. It's light, which means I could use my power more often. And it works, it works. So, yeah, this is just like, um, nothing major. It restores 25% shields when the clip empties. And it looks cool. Look at this. Old, reliable Avenger. It just screams Mass Effect. And I, I went back to the Matok, guys. Uh, it just fits... First of all, I have so many points in Assault Rifle, so it, it, it makes sense to have a precise Assault Rifle instead of a Sniper Rifle. And I just love the look of the Matok. As you can see, when it comes to weapons, looks are very important to me. <laughs> it looks, it's, it's, sexy, it's a sexy weapon. And again, this has the 25% restore shields and power damage to shields. Uh, just, I think it has the same, yeah, almost the same. Good old reliable assault rifle. And armor-wise, armor uh, I do have the Pathfinder Heavy Energy Plating, Mark VI now, which are the Pathfinder Legs. Yes, this is just a small upgrade. I haven't changed anything really. It's shields, it's max health. This one is jump melee bonuses. Uh, damage resistance, damage resistance for days. Uh, this special thing that I've had all the time. Uh, and health, health, health. Consumables. 
Ammo, ammo, ammo. Shitty capacitors. I don't want to die. And here we have the wonderful Nomad. So, let's talk about skills, shall we? Let's get our walk out here, real slow like. Wasting everyone's time. Okay. Skills. So, I haven't done any changes to the tech skills. They are still the same. I still have all of these guys ready for action. Um, I actually think... What could I... I'm a... Technical savant. No. Look at this. Um, that is... That is pretty good. Man, I do love my tech constructs. Uh, but what I have done is I added some stuff in biotics. Now, this is... Some of you have pointed out to me that when I said, like, it feels weird that I'm just suddenly a biotic in the middle of the game, why should I point, put points in biotic skills? Did I just, like, miraculously get biotic skills? Well, yes and no. As I see it, uh, and the writers have done a very cool thing here. It's Felix, uh, writer's, writer's mother was a woman who researched biotic amps and element zero. And as we know, biotics are, uh, human biotics are formed when they have been exposed to element zero in the womb, which is the case here, I presume. It, the ESO even killed our mother. So it makes sense for Felix to be biotic. Uh, I'm seeing this guy as a... He hasn't really... He has a biotic amp in his head. But he hasn't been able to fine-tune his biotics in any way. Maybe he was able to push a glass like a few centimeters. But that's it. But now, with Sam's help, he's been able to do something about... All he uh, do something with his biotic powers. Uh, that's my lore background for all of this. And I thought to myself, I need, I need this. I need barrier. Because uh, I want, I want more shields, and I especially want this. That shields are, are restored when I'm in critical condition. I just want to be able to take a lot of punishment. So, I've thought to myself, what do I need to have? I need to have 9 points in Biotics before I go and before I'm able to put any points at all in Barrier, because it's locked otherwise. So, I thought to myself, you know what? You know what? Nova. Bam. You don't need any fine control, nor fine tuning. This is just massive AoE damage. Bam. It's done. <laughs> so, I'm guessing Ryder... Felix Ryder is not a very... He's not a biotic with finesse. Because he, he's not good enough to fine-tune his powers to do throw or pull or charge. He just like, okay, you know what, Sam? I'm not a very good biotic, but I can unleash all my biotics into my fist and slam the ground. So, that works. And of course, uh, afterwards he will learn how to... Um, uh, he's he's currently learning how to form a biotic field around himself to protect himself. There we go. How's that for nerdiness? Yes. Uh, the favorites are still the same. I have biotic. Uh, I have Nova in uh, in four. Okay. Well then. I think, well, I came uh, uh, I came in under 10 minutes of me just talking about my specs and equipment this time. So that's that's a victory for me. Uh, no let's head down. Kadara. Yeah, let's head down to Kadara real quick. Uh, we have a beer run to do. We need to get some beer for Kesh, I believe. So, snacks. We need beer. 
Hey, Cora. Saw a few places like this in my commando days. Trading posts and the terminus systems. Good places for fugitives to hide, or try to. But not from Asari commandos, huh? Let's just say hiding with an arms merchant isn't as smart as you'd think. Especially when one of the commandos hunting you is that merchant's little sister. Oh. I hear you. Wait, where's Tara? She moved on to bigger things. This is my shop now. But she promised me shooting lessons. I paid her. Aww. I know how to shoot. Pay me. I'll give you a good price. <laughs> yeah, I'm guessing people have changed up now when um, when the collective is in charge. You know what? Take Shopping spree. I could have done this all off camera. But you know what? I don't wanna. Oh, we don't want any of those. Okay. What are we looking at? We need something here. Sure thing, Cora. I miss my armor. Okay, what what do you want me to do here? Do you want me to jump the counter? Vetro's probably right at home here. Hey, don't mind me. Okay. There's only so many directions to go. I can go this way. No, I can go this way. Nope. I can go this way. Nope. And I can go this way. No. Okay. Uh, best booze in the universe has moved. Those jerks shut me down and kicked me out of Karara port. If you want real booze, not, not just not the wash they serve here, come to my secret stash spot, if you dare. Dun dun dun, said. Oh. Are you kidding me? Do I have to... I have to go outside? Okay, sure. I'm gonna get this beer. Even if it's if it, even if it's the last thing I do. And you guys are just gonna have to go along with the ride. I know there's a lot of important things to do. Almost didn't expect to see you. Why? Because of Kadara's little change in management. Sloan was good to me, but she's dead. My loyalty means nothing to her now. Hello? Take it this beauty is yours? The Tempest? Yeah, she's mine. Hell of a ship. We don't get many like her. Colt Dalton, Kadara Docks Manager. Get strict orders from the Charlatan to take good care of you. Nice. Mostly nice of them. You'd know better than me. How safe is it here? Eh, safety's a commodity on Kadara. Depends on how much you're willing to spend. The port's gun free. But murder comes in all shapes and sizes. Still better than living outside the mountain. It's no man's have, land out there. Have we... Have we done this already? At uh, confession time, it's been two weeks since I last played this game. Because, you know, full-time job and a whole lot of editing. Edit, 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 edit. Uh, I'm loving it, but it takes up so much time. Uh, so I can't remember if we've done this or not. But you know what? Let's just keep on talking. Does Kadara get a lot of traffic? Since we moved in? Oh yeah. Kadara is one of the few planets in Helios with a functioning economy. Got Angara and exiles from all over Helios moving their cargo through this port. Thanks for your time. <sighs> Back to work. Yeah, we have so much, so many important <laughs> things to do. I don't see you eyeing my gear. Oh, I'm eyeing you, Vetra. Hey, Ryder. Uh, okay. Slums. Um, nah. Let's let's bring my tough girls. They will protect me. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Cryo Gauntlet, Tech Pattern. Uh, I'm not sure how good it is, because the damage is way below anything else. But it does freeze people, and it feels kind of techy. Uh, if it doesn't suit me, 
I'll just switch it out to uh, the tech blade. Or an Asari blade, which I found when I opened one of my loot boxes uh, from the uh, phone app. But, uh, probably not. What's good with the Remnant Gauntlet, however, is that it has a whole lot of um, slots for power-ups and stuff. Man, my armor is looking cool. I love the arms together with uh, the rest of the outfit. Feels a little bit bulkier than the normal uh, Pathfinder arms. Okay, so where do we need? Oh yeah, I bought a new upgrade to the uh, Nomad. Agility mode. I think it's faster. Uh, okay, the VSA system helps stabilize the vehicle when turning, so I can disable that. Is that good? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I'm just gonna drive there and try out this uh, agility mod. We got Hold pretty on. lucky with this crew. All said and done, Gil, Callow, Suvi, especially Suvi. So smart, cool under pressure, and that voice. Yes. If a person could ever fall for a voice, there it is. Got them all. That voice is real cool. Okay, let's try. Sorry, excuse me, dinosaur. Yes. Okay. Woo! Okay. Is this better? Oh, I'm drifting like... Whoa! This is insane! Go, go, Marco Power! Oh my god, it's all the... This is make all over again. Oh, this is safe now. Oh, that is awesome. <laughs> Hello, bootlegger. Pathfinder, Kesha's assistant asked you to secure some of that. Let's do it. What'll it be? Bottle of your hardest stuff. This is for Superintendent Cash. Make it <laughs> six. <laughs> All right, we did it, team. We did it. Okay, so my plan right now is to. Uh, you you guys remember that three sabers thing we got from Sid on the Nexus? Uh, she wanted us to find a few nab points, so let's go check those out and then go back to the Nexus for, uh, for a quick visit. Then, I'm thinking about f trying to find the Asari Ark. Thank you, do you have a new email? Oh my god, yes. Um, hello, Ryder. They're saying you got... Uh, hmm, I think we've done this already. You were right. From Mildred Womsis. You probably won't remember me, but I stopped you on the Nexus and bent your ear about the Angara on our station. You told me to get to know them. Yeah, I remember this guy. And I've done, and I've done my best too. Since they seem thoughtful and worthy of our trust, so yeah, you should keep doing what you're doing. Good luck out there. Ah. Uh, update on Kadara from Reyes. I've ordered visible and some not so visible patrols to guard your outpost. The outcasts have already mounted a few attacks, but nothing we couldn't handle. As promised, 
I'll do everything in my power to keep your people safe. Raise. Ha! Oh, awesome! Dear customer, from Bootleggers Association of Kadara, we appreciate your previous business and hope you enjoyed our unique power-packed homebrewed spirits. We are constantly improving and experimenting on new blends, so be, uh, so be sure to check back on us. Sincerely, Zed, founder of Bayok. And from Lexi, thank you. I appreciate you coming to find me on the Nexus. I apologize for running off like that. It was unprofessional and won't happen again. One day, when things calm down, we should get drinks for real. Unwind like friends. Purely platonic, of course, Lexi. Oh, but she's so cute too. No, David, focus. Oh, too many interesting women in my life right now. Um, where am I going? Here it is. We need to investigate space attacks on Nexus Nexus ships. Sites investigated one of four. Yeah, let's do that. We're already out in space, so let's check it out. No orbiting Kadara. And we also need to go back to uh, to uh, the Nexus to deliver our um, drinks to Cash. Cash's assistant. Anomaly detected. Okay. Some minerals Deposit. for us. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. I think I have plenty of minerals, to be honest, but we'll see. Okay. Uh, life of the frontier. Okay, so there's a few. Oh my god, there's gonna be a few jumps. Here we go. Hello, son. Oh, space is so cool. Anomaly detected. Okay. Scourge. I found something. Let's say Angaran ship. The ship and its entire crew transporting minerals was expected at the Nexus, but never docked. It was presumed lost in the scourge. Analysis suggests that the Daisy's navigational systems may have been compromised. Hmm, do you mean like sabotaged? Or compromised in damage um, when uh, you know during gunfire. Well, at least we got some stuff. That's one down. And uh, let's go to Juba. Take us in, Carlo. Oh, I still can't believe I'm playing a new Mass Effect game. I don't know how this will end, and that is so cool. I have so much nice story ahead of me. And hopefully a lot of dif difficult <clears throat> moral choices. Anomaly on sensors. No, that was not it. Found. Scanning for the The Churris was a transport shuttle with a full cargo of supplies. According to the ship's final transmission, it lost its way after an unexpected interference resulted in navigation failure. Hmm, again? Damage on parts of the ship's hull suggests that it came into contact with a hostile, sh with a hostile force shortly after losing contact with the Nexus. 
this is uh, serious things. We can't have pirates uh, disrupting our supply lines. This uh, this was good good work, Sid. This was uh, indeed important. We need to sort this out. Okay, last one. Another wreckage, then. This should give us a final location, Ryder. Got it. I'll forward all the information to your Omni tool. Great. Ship Nightingale. An emergency medical ship staffed with medical technicians. The Nightingale was dispatched to a far-flung mining station, but, but was lost along the way. Survivors who reached Escape pods believe it was a cat attack. There is no corroborating evidence to be found in the wreckage. Oh, such... <sighs> they killed doctors and medical technicians? Damn them. Hi, that's... Oh, Kadara. Okay, well then. You know where we're going. Kadara. Okay, it should be here somewhere. Okay, so we've got to travel down this road and find the hideout. Okay, so we want uh, incendiary ammo on this. Twelve seconds. Well, we can wait twelve seconds. That's okay. Look, my shields are purple now when I have barrier. That's cool. Barrier and shields, by the way. Does it say barrier or shield? Yeah. Okay, has it gone 12 seconds? Yes. Uh, which, which weapon do we have? Okay, we want cryo ammo on our Avenger. And lastly, on the mattock, we want incendiary. No, we want disruptor. Okay, the entrance is over there. Let's park here somewhere. Okay, incendiar ammo, cryo ammo, disruptor ammo. Enemies. Oh, they're already here. Party just got bigger. Yep, see it. Thanks, Zoe. Nice. I'm assaulting. <laughs> well done. That was a good assault. But I do miss 
and miss the turrets sometimes. Because he's just a good guy, you know? He deserves to be in the forefront of battle. Examine. Three Sabres Memo. I don't want to hear about it. We all knew ousting Yale would make the break with the Nexus final. No loss, that teat was running dry. Going independent isn't just the smart move, it's the only move. Now we got the gear and the freedom to make uh, okay, now we got the gear and the freedom to take over this place. Angara, not a problem. Here Yale's here Yale's on EOS. Forget him. He won't talk. Anything he brings up will expose his involvement. Oh. And the Nexus involvement. He's not going to put himself in that position. Cochrane. Okay, EOS next. This former leader, Yale. He's on EOS. He was their tie to the Nexus. We'll have to talk to him to get to the root of this. Yes. I'm saving everything we found as proof. It'll come in handy. Oh, well, well then, uh, to yours.